seven and twenty two in in the near future. So I hope you all well. Yeah. Um, before your um, holiday, before your vacation, uh, if you have any uh, procurement plans or kitchen wares that need to confirm before your vacation, yeah, um, this will be a really good time because uh, after your vacation, we will have our vacation soon because um, the next year's uh, Luna Spring Festival will come very soon. It will be at the um, first day of uh, February. So um, catch your time to confirm the order, okay? Um, yesterday, we have introduced you a lot of uh, different types of kitchen gadgets. It um, includes, um, yeah, the can opener, um, the most frequently used gadget, uh, some fruit and vegetable gadgets such as peeler, um, um, melon bola and apple cola, etc. If you are interested in kitchen, uh, kitchen gadgets and uh, have uh, procurement requests, you can check the replay on our website uh, for the yesterday's live stream, okay? Yeah, our website address is 3w.kisar.cn 3w.kisar.cn Hello, welcome friend, welcome to Just Us Live. Yeah, here I wish you a really good December. Um, okay. Yeah, as I said, if you missed the live show yesterday, you can check a replay on our website. Uh, our website address is 3 cn. Yeah, you can also check some information about our company on our website. And of course, our products. Yeah, our product range is very... You, Our product range, uh, it's kindly white. It uh, covers many different types of kitchen products, it, um, including kitchen knives, uh, kitchen utensils, kitchen gadgets, baking tours, um, uh, barbecue tours, and garden tours. Okay, if you have any inquiries about this kind of products, you can send me inquiry. You can send me email. My email address is salesby at just out of CN. Salesby at just out of CN. My name is Stephanie, okay? Okay, today um, we will, I will introduce you several types of chef pie, okay? Uh, if you are interested in chef pie, or if, if you want to learn more about chef pie, you can um, pay attention to my introduction. Just stay with me and enjoy the life. And if you like my um, introduction, you can give me a like. Yeah, you can give me some likes, okay? Thank you in advance. Um, as you know, uh, Kitchen Nice is our main products. Yeah, main. Hello, welcome to today's live. Welcome to today's live. Yeah, I wish all the visitors that come in our live room a really fruitful and joyful December, okay? Uh, let's start today's introduction. Yeah, I will introduce you some different types of chef knife. As you as we all know, chef knife it's the it's a most frequently used and popular knife type among all the knife types. Okay. Compared to the bread knife, um parry knife, utility knife, chef knife is the most popular one because it's uh, most functional and practical one. Okay. First of all, I would like to show you a new type. Uh, uh, it's a new arrival, okay? We have a set. It includes chef knife, parry knife, utility knife, sentoto knife, chopper knife. But today, I would like to introduce uh, the chef knife, okay? Let me show you first. Yeah, it's this knife. Yeah, it's really a uh, beautiful knife. Yeah. Um, welcome, new friend. Okay, uh, this is the first chef knife that I'd like to introduce, uh, I would like to recommend to you. Uh, as you can see, it has a very good visual looking, right? Yeah. Mm. Let's check uh, more. Let's check closer. Yeah, for you to check. Yeah. Okay. It has wooden handle. It has wooden handle. Okay. This is the blade part and this is the handle part. This is the handle part. Um, 
Okay, uh, it's a it's an eight-inch shaft nut. It's an eight-inch shaft nut. Okay, and as you can see, uh, the blade part, the blade part, um, has two color. The top part, uh, it's like a black color, and the blade part, it's a silver color. Yeah, this is the original color of the metal of the stainless steel. And uh, on the bottom part, because uh, it is uh, oxidizing. So it looks like black, and uh, you can check there are many dimples on the blade uh, because it is hammered. It is hammered, yeah. So it has many dimples on the blade. Uh, it's very really good because uh, it can keep the vegetables or meat or um, other ingredients that when you slice, it can uh, easily get off the blade. Uh, that for non-stick function, non-stick function, okay? So that's the function of the dimples. Mm. The meat or the vegetables won't stick on the blade. It will just get rid of the blade very easily, yeah. And uh, you can also check the thickness. You can also check the thickness. It's very thick. It's very thick compared to the normal 1.5 millimeters. Uh, it's about... Uh, 2.5 millimeters, 2.5 millimeters. So uh, you don't need to worry about the hardness of this uh, chef knife. Uh, it can deal with some harder ingredients. Yeah, even though the meat is unfrozen enough, you can also use this chef knife to uh, slice the unfrozen meat. Yeah, the not total, not complete unfrozen meat, okay? And, uh, the, uh, talking about the material, the blade material is 5CR15 stainless steel. 5CR15 stainless steel. So it has very good hardness and good sharpness for daily using. You know, uh, you are a very professional chef, you are a, a cook. Uh, this knife is very good. Yeah, it's good enough. It's a very professional one. And if you want to get better material like 7CR, uh, stainless steel that's also acceptable. We can change the blade material according to your needs, okay? Uh, the cost will be different uh, according to different material, okay? Mm, but 5CR15 is good enough for their using, for their using. Uh, also, because it is 5CR15, so uh, it is absolutely corrosion resistant. Yeah, it can ensure the corrosion uh, in corrosion resistant, okay? So it's very durable. You can use it for a very long time, a very long time, okay? Mm, this is the blade part, this is the blade part. And as to the handle part, as to the handle part, uh, the handle, it's made by wood. So it's a wooden handle, it's made by rosewood, it's made by rosewood. Uh, so the, yeah, the color and the quality is quite good, it's quite good. And you can check the shape. You can check the shape from the butt. From the butt, yeah. It's an up no shape. Yeah, so it ensures the comfortability. Yeah, when you grab it, you can feel it's very comfortable, okay. And uh, because this handle part is quite long, so uh, you can manipulate the, the whole shaft line. Oh Hello, welcome new friend. Welcome to today's live. And uh, I'd like I will introduce several types of chef knives today. Okay. Uh, if you are interested in chef knife or kitchen knife, you can pay attention to my introduction. And here uh, I just introduced the blade material as well as the handle material of this type. Yeah. And you can check the shape. Yeah, you can check the shape according to the bot. Okay, uh, it's quite long, no matter the blade part or the handle part. So when you grab it, you can feel it's very comfortable and you can manipulate this knife uh, according to your uh, spectrums and the uh, faults, okay? It can increase the... <clears throat> speed when you slice the meat. Hello, welcome, welcome friend. Welcome to today's live. Okay, yeah. 
so this is quite good. This is quite good. And also, it's double edge. The blade part is double edge. So no matter you are a left-handed uh, user or right-handed user, it's all uh, friendly to you because it is double edge. The blade part is double edge. You can use by your left hand or you can use it by your right hand. It's very good. It's friendly to a uh, left-handed user, okay? And uh, if you want to get your laser logo, uh, I suggest two plates for your laser logo. The one, the first plate is laser on this silver, silver part because the upper part is black. If you get a laser logo, it will not very, uh, it will be unclear and not very obvious. So I suggest you laser it um, on this silver part, just like this, just like this. Okay, here I get a laser logo. Yeah, right here. And this is the first plate uh, that I uh, suggest. And the second place, you can get a laser logo on this uh, wooden handle. Wooden handle. You can get it right here or at the butt or at the butt or both. You can get two logo. You can get two logo. Okay. Mm. Customized logo is acceptable. Customized logo is acceptable. Um, this is the chef knife. As I said, uh, we still have the other types. Uh, I'll, I'll show you, but I want to do a very specific introduction. Okay, here. Yeah, we have. Uh, this is the chocolate knife. This is the chocolate knife. Yeah, it's not very big. This size is very suitable for female using. It's not as big as the Chinese cleaver. So this is the chocolate knife, and um, uh, here we still got a, this is a utility knife, this is a utility knife. We also have Sentoku knife, but right now I don't have it, so I want to show you, show it to you. Um, if you want to get, see the picture of all the knife type, you can click the link that show on your screen. Uh, there is more detailed information and introduction about this knife, about this knife, okay? Also, this uh, wooden knife block is available. If you want to get a full set, uh, including the wooden block that's acceptable, okay? Just send me your request, send me the inquiry. I will uh, call you as soon as possible after this live, okay? Yeah, just let me know your inquiry. And uh, about the packaging, if you just choose this single piece, single knife, uh, I will recommend you the magnetic gift box packaging. Yeah, if you choose a set, uh, gift box or color box is available. Okay, it's recommended. Uh, as to this knife, there is a really good point is that we accept very low MOQ. We accept really, really low MOQ, okay? Um, for the other knife type, we really uh, required 1,000 MOQ. But for this knife type, we only require 200 MOQ for each type, for each piece, okay? for each knife type. So if you really want to start your business, Amazon business, uh, yes, or eBay business, just uh, with very low MOQ with first trial order in small quantity, just catch the chance. This knife is really uh, popular right now, selling on Amazon. So yeah, with really low ammo too, okay. If you are interested in this, just let me know. Just let me know your request, okay. So this is the first type that I would like to introduce. And next, I would like to introduce two Damascus knife. Two Damascus knife is really high end, okay. So let's move to the next one. Um, first of all, let's check this one. Let's check this one. Yeah, it's a really high-end Damascus knife. Uh, also very popular. Many people can sell, uh, can sell the price uh, and some detailed information with me uh, about this knife. Uh, this is a chef knife. As I said today, I would like to introduce chef knife only, okay? Because chef knife is the most frequently used one, yeah. Uh, it has very beautiful Damascus pattern. Uh, I can show you closer. Yeah, you can track on the blade. 
uh, there are some wave pattern, wave pattern. Yeah, uh, this is made by Damascus steel. Yeah, very high quality Damascus steel. It's 67 layers, 67 layers. So uh, when you see the blade, there are some wave on the blade. It's real Dam Damascus steel pattern. Yeah, it's real, real. And the Damascus pattern, it's natural. So uh, even though uh, you have the two same knife type, but the pattern will be different. The pattern will be different, okay? The pattern will be different. Uh, as to the handle part, as to the handle part, it's uh, made by Paka Wood. Yeah, it's made by Paka Wood. And here we have a red ring. It's G10 red ring. Uh, this red ring is for decoration, which makes the pearl knife look uh, more high end, more high classic. Okay, yeah. Uh, it's kindly heavy on the handle part. The handle part is really heavy. So when you use the knife, you can save some energy and increase the efficiency when you slice something, when you cut some something, okay? Because this handle part is heavier than the blade part. So it will fall down uh, automatically when you slice the meat or slice the vegetable. So it can uh, increase the efficiency and save your effort, save your effort, okay? Yeah. Uh, also, you can get laser logo, but I do not suggest you get a laser logo on the blade part because the blade part has very natural, beautiful damask pattern. Uh, I suggest you laser the logo on the butt right here. Yeah, you can uh, laser the logo right here. And the second place that you can laser the logo is right here uh, at this both set. You can laser both sides. Laser it on both sides or just single side or just one side. Okay, that's or acceptable or acceptable. Yeah, we do not re uh, suggest laser it on the blade because it has really beautiful natural Damascus pattern. Uh, it's made by 67 layers Damascus steel, which has really, really, really good quality. Yeah, um, it, we have domestic Damascus steel and the uh, uh, Japanese Damascus still uh the price of them uh is a little bit different the japanese one is higher than the domestic one but both of them has good quality okay so we will quote according to your choice according to your choice yes uh as you can see uh the packaging we have a hand tag right here yeah this is a hand tag we have a string uh with the tag right here uh on this tag you can laser your Brand name, brand logo. Yeah, this is the first uh, packaging way, and it will be packed in a very high-end uh, magnetic gift box. Magnetic gift box, okay. That it will look looks more high-end, looks more high-end, and we will have a PVC light cover to protect the blade. To protect the blade, uh, it, the sharpening and the hardness is really good. It's really good. It's also double edge. It also has double edge blade, so it's friendly uh, to left-handed user or right-handed right-handed user. Okay, so this is the real Damascus steel knife. But some people think uh, the cost may be a little bit higher, uh, maybe a little bit high. Uh, but also, uh, you want to get a high-end knife, but want to uh, lower the cost. That's okay, no problem. And I will recommend you another knife type, okay? Let's check this one. Oh, you can compare. They are really the same. Uh, they are similar. They are similar. Not the same, sorry. They are similar, okay? You can check this one. Um, you can see there is also some Damascus pattern on the blade, but it's not real one. It's not real one. It's just laser. It's just laser on the blade, yeah. Just laser on the blade. Uh, I can show you the one that do not have the pattern. Yeah, it's just a normal chef knife. It's normal chef knife. Actually, they are the same type. They are the same type. This one is the normal blade, and this one uh, we have some laser pattern on the blade. 
you can compare. Yeah. So uh, if you want to lower your cost, you want to lower your cost and want to get Damascus pattern, you can choose this type. You can choose this type because this kind uh, of mine is not made by real Damascus steel. It's just made by 3 CR13 stainless steel or 5 CR15 stainless steel. Yeah, it's made by stainless steel. And after that, we will um, use the machine, laser the similar Damascus pattern on the blade. Yeah, it's laser. But this is real one. This is real one. Yeah, this is from the um, material itself. But uh, as to this pattern, it's mm, human made. It's human made. Yeah, it's uh, we can say artificial one. Artificial one. Okay. Uh, this is also a chef knife. This is also a chef knife and has a bolster right here and has a butt and has a butt. Okay. Uh, as to the handle, the handle is also made by wood. It's also made by wood. Uh, it's, it's made by Parker Wood. It's made by Parker Wood, okay? So that's why I uh, said this is mm, similar to this one. Yeah, they almost have the same type, the same shape. Uh, besides to the handle, the handle, uh, this one is has a straight handle, straight handle. And this handle, it's a little bit curved. Is a little bit curved, but both of them are chef knife and has bolster, has wooden handle and uh, butt. Yeah. So for this one, you can also laser the logo on the butt or on the bolster or even on the blade, or even on the blade, because this is laser uh, laser pattern, laser Damascus pattern on the blade. So uh, it doesn't matter if you want to laser the logo on the blade part. Okay. Um, this is also heavier. The handle is heavier than the blade part. So uh, this is, can also save your efforts and uh, increase the efficiency, increase the efficiency. Um, the price is much, much lower than the real one. Yeah, it's, I guess the price of this real one, it's five times compared to this one. So if you want to save your course, but uh, want to get a high-end chef knife, uh, this is a very good choice. This is a very good choice, okay? And as I showed you before, um, for this knife, you can uh, get a very high-end packaging as well. For this single knife, we really suggest you to choose the Magnetic heat box just like this. Yeah, it's a magnetic heat box, but without any design. You can do your own design on the surface. And this is the mate. Yeah, it's mate. And without any printing. And let's check inside. Inside, it's a EVA tray. Yeah, this is all black EVA tray. You can uh, you can choose the one with a uh, flock. Yeah, we have red flocking tray or black flocking tray that will look more high-end look more high-end and more high class okay so uh this is a really good packaging for single piece knife for single piece knife especially for chef knife yeah uh so this kind of packaging is highly recommended if you uh choose this single knife if you choose this single knife okay so uh this is the third type of knife that I introduced to you guys. Uh, yeah, you can track according to your needs. Uh, as to the cost, the cost of this real Damascus knife is highest. It's the highest one. And then next, uh, this is the medium cost. Medium cost. The lowest cost is this one. The lowest cost is this one. Of course, you can choose the one. Uh, without the pattern, without any pattern, just a normal chef knife, just normal chef knife, okay? So here are four types of chef knife that uh, you can choose, that you can choose, okay? You can uh, choose it according to your needs, but the MOQ is different, MOQ is different. For these two type, for these two type, um, they are the same type. One has laser pattern, the other one does not. 
For these two types, it requires 1,000 for each type, 1,000 pieces for each type. And as to the lead time, uh, it's about 40 to 50 days, 40 to 50 days, okay? So this is the MOQ for these two types. Um, for this road mask pattern line, it requires only 500. It only requires 500 pieces, 500 pieces. Delay time is also about uh, 40 to 60 days, 40 to 60 days, okay? We need to order the raw material. So it will take some time for us uh, to prepare the raw material. So uh, this knife requires 500, 500 pieces. And as to this one, it only requires 200 pieces, 200 pieces. So I highly recommend this one to you because uh, it costs medium. It has medium cost and with the lowest MOQ, lowest MOQ, okay? Yeah. Uh, you can compare that the length, the length, yeah. The length of this knife is the biggest one. You can compare them. It has the longest length. You can compare. So um, it's really good. It's really good because the handle is long enough and the blade is long enough. The blade is long enough. So when you hold this knife uh, or when you manipulate this knife, uh, you can control it easily and comfortably according to your own uh, posture, yeah. And no matter for left-handed use or right-handed use, it's both friendly to you because it's a double-edged design, double-edged design. So this, this one is the most recommended one um, among these four types that I, uh, that I introduced to you today, that I introduced to you today, okay? Uh, we have many other type uh, chef knife. Uh, we have hollow handle type, and we have other forge knife, and uh, stainless steel knife, plastic coating knife. Um, knife. Hello, welcome to today's live. It is the first day of the December, and it is the first live show of December. So welcome to enter our live show. This is Stephanie. And um, I have introduced you four chef nights today, four chef nights. And the one on my hand, it's the most recommended one. It's the most recommended one. It requires only 200 pieces MOQ, 200 pieces MOQ. If you are interested in this knife, just contact me, okay? Just contact me, send me inquiries, send me your requests, send me your any questions, that's okay, that's okay, okay. Uh, uh, if you have any questions, you can leave your question right now. Uh, I can answer you uh, right away, okay? I can answer you right away. Um, I will, uh, my part's introduction will come to an end quickly. And if you have any questions, you can leave your uh, message or just contact me uh, via my email. Send your questions or inquiries to my email, okay? Um, here I repeat my email address one more time. Uh, it's sales5, sales5 at just have to see it. Sales5 at just have to see it, yeah. Okay, uh, my introduction. It's ends right here, and uh, our life will continue, okay? Just don't go away. If you want to get more information about um, Kitchen Knife, just stay in our sh live show, okay? Uh, I'll see you in the next live show. Bye-bye.
Hello, you guys. Welcome to our live show. The topic of our live show today is about the knives. So, uh, just now, my colleagues Daphne have introduced you with some um sharp knife, and next, I'd like to bring you about about two kinds of knife sets here. So, the first set that I'd like to introduce you with this one. This one you can actually see is actually a combination set. You you know, not only just see the knives, but also we also provide you with one scissor and one pillar here. This is also a two in one multifunctional pillar. So this set can actually meet almost all of your all your kitchen needs about the about cutting, about peeling, or about whatever you need. Because this set, so Next, I'd like to introduce this set for you one by one. Introduce you with this set. The first set here. And the first one that I'd like to... First, it will contain five common knives that we will use during our daily knives. During daily knives. Just as we as we all know, most in, in most cases, the knife set will include including fine knives, the sharp knife, the slicer knife, and the bread knife, paring knife, and the utility knife. This set will also contain that five kinds of knives. So, just let me take it. We also have these five kinds of knives here, like this one. This is the first one. Uh, a chef knife here. This is a chef knife, an eight inch chef knife, an eight inch chef knife. Like this one here. You can see this one, there's the blade part material is stainless steel, it's stainless steel. And as for the handle part here is the plastic one. It's a PP handle. It's a PP handle. You can see that. And you also notice that the color of the blank part is black. It's black. The reason that it's black because there's actually a non-stick coating here. This is actually one kind of non-stick coating here. That's why it looks like this, like the color one. But still, you can see the primary color of the stainless steel. Then you could, if you see clearly, see it. From the cutting part here, cut the cutting edge of the blank here, you will see the there's another, there's the other color, the primary color of the Fossier 13 stainless steel. So the main material of the blank part is Fossier 13 stainless steel. The reason that it looks like black just because we add some non-stick coating here, add some non-stick coating here. So that's why the this chef knife looks black from the blank part to the handle part here and you also see, see this whole set is the set this whole set is the same style they are the pure black design and if you are going to if you want to change its color or you want to change its design it's acceptable it's acceptable so this is the first one here and Eight inch chef knife and eight inch chef knife. Apart from it, we also have an eight inch slicer knife, an eight inch slicer knife. See this one. The difference is comparing with the chef knife. The only difference is their blank part. Is the blank part because in order to meet different kinds of demands, we will change the change the design of the blank part here of the blank part here but generally other characteristics are totally the same are totally the same like the material the coating the material of the handle the design of the handle they will be totally the same they will be totally the same this one this is a slicer knife or some friends will also call it as a Oh, probably the only knife. 
the kinds of knife. The third knife that I'd like to introduce you with an eight-inch brand knife. An eight-inch brand knife. Through its cutting edge, this with this serrated edge, I guess most friends will be very familiar with this kind of bread. Bread knife because in bread will be part of our daily bread. Actually, one kind of meat food that we will need in our daily life. So, and unlike those very soft bread. If we are going to eat the bread or uh, to replace the rice, actually that kind of bread will be very um, tough or hard to buy buy them directly. In that cases, you you will need such kind of bread knife to cut them into pieces. To cut them into pieces. If you buy it in the supermarket like Walmart, of course there will be some machine to help you cut your bread into pieces. But if you just buy the whole one and you take that whole one back to home, and at, your, at home you will need such kind of tool to help you to cut the bread into pieces. Of course, oh my God, you welcome you new friends, welcome new friends. So this is the function of the bread knife, I guess more friends. Some friends will be more familiar with this kind of knife than me because, because we are Chinese, so actually we seldom eat bread. Or we will just probably will eat some like you call bao in the in the or for the breakfast not and some very soft bread. In most cases we won't we won't eat those bread very tough. So in so actually this kind of knife will be relatively rare in Chinese families, but in Western families, this one will be very popular and a common one. So this is the third one. And the fourth one is actually a five-inch utility knife. A five-inch utility knife. You can see it. This kind of knife, just like its name, is very multifunctional and practical in our daily life. No matter you are going to open a delivery package or you are going to open something, you need some little knife to cut the things. This one will be a perfect choice. This utility oh my knife. God, dude, what the Welcome, new friends. This one will be a perfect choice for you to use it. This kind of utility knife here. And later, the last one is actually a 3.5 inch pairing knife. 3.5 inch pairing knife here. Wait a minute. This is a 3.5 inch pairing knife. This knife will be very suitable for you to peel and like peel the fruit like an apple, a pear, a beach, that kind of wood. This one. So right now I've introduced you with five kinds of common knives that in our kitchen. One chef knife, slicer knife, and one bread knife. One utility knife and one pairing knife here. So this set will contain these five common kinds knife. Five common knives. And after you using it, after you after you using this knife I would recommend you to clean it with the flowing water or with some soapy water and don't put them back into the into such kind of stand directly. Um, I would advise you to put it back, to put them back until they are already in their already dry, in order to dry. Otherwise it will be rusted very easily. So in their dry condition, you can put them back into the stand. This will not only let all the knives uh, look like very in order, but also it will be very convenient for you to, if you are going to use it the second time. So, and besides, it's also very safe for your family members, especially for your children, because if you put those, put these knives randomly, some probably your children will just touch it accidentally so if you put it back and told them it's dangerous it's not su not suitable for you to use or, or to play then probably your 
kids will listen to you and they won't touch this kind of dangerous food because for little kids, knives are very dangerous for them. So apart from these fine knives, we also have other kinds of knives for you to use because in our daily life, we will also enjoy probably like something like a stick, enjoy pizza, enjoy cheese. And if you don't mind, if you don't, you are not care about the specific knives or specific usage. Of course, you this uh, those five common knives already can be your needs. But if you pursue, you I have to use the specific. I have to use the detail knife for its specific usage. We all we can also provide you with that kind of knives in that set in this set here. Like this set first, we have. Three. Actually, we have four stick knives. We have four stick knives. We have four. We can provide you with four 4.5 inch stick knives here. 4.5 stick knives here. Yeah, totally the same. Yeah, totally the same. You can see it. First thing. So this is the stick knives here. It's also the serrated. The cutting edge is also the serrated one almost to the tip part, the tip part here. Oh, of course, the tip here, the little tip here will be sharp because sometimes we'll still, we will still need to use this tip to cut the stick, this one. This one, this set has four pieces in total, has four pieces in total. If you are only interested in these thin knives and you want to um, probably you want six sticks to make a new set, that's also okay, that's also okay. If you don't have specific or you don't have other requirements of it, then we will provide you with only four pieces, only four pieces. If you have needs, please tell us, please tell us. So, this is five, but no, four stick knives here. The reason that we will put four pieces here because we hope that next time when you are going to enjoy the stick, probably you can invite your friends or your family members to have stick with you together so that you can communicate with each other. So we first, we can provide you with four pieces of stick knives. And apart from the stick knives here, it also, Oh, it's my mistake. Actually, this one we can provide you with six pieces of stick knives. Six pieces because these two are also the stick knives. So it's my wrong here. So this set actually has six pieces of stick knives. Six pieces. And so right now we already have 11, 11 pieces knives. 11 pieces. Five common use, five common types knives and six. Six stick knives here, six stick knives, and a pallet. We also have two extra knives, two extra knives. Through each trick, I guess some friends will already know its usage, already know it. Like this one, this one is very obvious, very obvious. Like its word, its word has been printed on the brain part here, on the brain part here. You can see it. The word is pizza. The word is pizza. So just like the pizza cutter, this pizza knife sharing the same function as the pizza cutter, as the pizza cutter, like this one here. So next time, if you are going to uh, do a homemade pizza or you are going to sharing pizza with your knife, this one will be very suitable for you to use this kind of pizza knife. Pizza knife here. And if some friends you are already familiar with this kind of pizza knife and you want to remove the word from the blank, you just want the blank to be like just like this one, like the utility knife, it's also uh, okay. You then you can tell us. So we will remove, so we won't produce this word on on the blank part if you need it, if you need it. Apart from the pizza knife, we also have as 